Hi, my name is Thomas Kim. I'm going to demonstrate how to prepare SRT subtitle part for, for use with Trados, for translation with Trados. The first step you need to understand is you have to uh, apply the add tag style macro, the first step. And then we will unselect, we will open find and replace dialog box and unselect pattern match. Then we will replace this paragraph tag with these symbols. Then the third step is also find and replace. Now this time we will unselect pattern match. Then I will replace. I have to select the pattern match first, then I will replace this text with Trados external tag. Then finally I will I will un unselect pattern match now and then I will find this text and replace it with this paragraph text. I will show you how to. This demonstration is for this this video is for how to convert subtitle part, especially SRT to for translation using Trados. Okay, this is Forest Gump sub, uh, subtitle SRT file format, and I will open it like this, and uh, I will use it uh, as. Sorry, I will use it cancel, and uh, since. Uh, Okay, it is open now. Then this, I will process this file for use with Trados. The first step I need to do is go to from view menu, view ribbon, and then macro, macro menu, um, view macro menu. Then click it. Then scroll down, scroll down. Add, add a tag style. This is macro name. Then click run. Okay. This step is very important. This is the first step we need to do. Then we have to change it, this file M to something like uh, prepare. I will change it prepare for translation like this. I will change the file M. And the first step is to to apply Trados Trados tags, Trados styles to our document. And then the second step is I will open Ctrl H, gives me find and replace dialog box, select detail. And the first step is uh, we will find, we will find paragraph style, paragraph text. Then we'll replace it with uh, this format. You can just copy and paste. I will why well, you can type with this text then find mode bakugi replace all i will i button replace all then you will find something like this and uh, we are, we are we need to we this is our first step so i applied this first step then the second step is i have to choose pattern match this is pattern match okay then in this Field in the find field, I will copy and paste, and this field to, to replace with replace text should be cleared. And I have to start. This is style, and th this is format, and this is style. So I open and I select TW for Win External, and I click OK. Then replace all. Then I have something like this, and. Finally, we have another another step. We will replace this one. Now we will we have to unselect pattern match, then find this text and replace it with paragraph tag. And we have to select uh, this. Then I will like I have to clear clear style. Okay, then clear style like this. It should be cleared with the style. Replace with text should should not have a style attribute. So I will push replace all. Okay, it's done. See, as you see, the, these text are uh, external, the Trados external uh, style. Trados external style is applied these to these text so we can you we can translate only the subtitle text not the time the time in time information 
This way, we can use Trados efficiently to translate subtitle files. Thank you for watching.